In a startling turn of events, Private Travis King, a U.S. soldier, has entered North Korea without authorization, leaving officials and witnesses perplexed. Just a day before the incident, he texted his military handlers at Incheon Airport in Seoul, South Korea, indicating his return to the U.S. However, King never boarded the plane, opting instead to join a tour in the Joint Security Area, JSA, inside the heavily fortified demilitarized zone. During the tour, King made a sudden dash across the border into North Korea, astonishing both fellow tourists and South Korean soldiers. Efforts to stop him proved futile as he disappeared into a country known for its hostility towards the U.S. The U.S. military was unaware of his absence until he failed to show up at his base in Fort Bliss, Texas. Officials are now engaged in a frantic search for answers, seeking to understand the motives behind King's actions. The U.S. government, along with South Korea and Sweden, is working tirelessly to ensure his safety and secure his return. The North Korean government has yet to respond to the U.S. military's attempts to resolve the situation. Prior to his unauthorized crossing, King had faced assault charges in South Korea, receiving a period of detention and hard labor as a consequence. His mother, shocked by her son's unexpected move, insists that she cannot imagine what might have driven him to venture into such dangerous territory. The case of Private Travis King remains a baffling mystery. As the investigation continues, U.S. officials seek to unravel the enigma behind his impulsive act, aiming to shed light on the unfolding events.